Go get it. Your offseason last year was such a big part of your journey and your progression as a player and really the Spurs title run. To not be able to do those similar things that helped you get there, was it a little frustrating? I think this is a new challenge for me and a, and a new goal that I've set and obviously a, a new circumstance that I haven't really been involved in. But that's the best thing about being a professional athlete is that you're constantly making new goals and, and trying to achieve them. So yes and no, I guess. You still managed to have quite a lot of fun this summer <laughs> running around with the Larry O'Brien trophy with your buddy, Aaron Baines. You guys ran up on that live shot. And so he's uh, had a heel problem as well. It was a good story. We were stuck in traffic. We came across uh, um, a cameraman and, and a reporter. Um, you know, little do we know that, that it was live and we decided to have a bit of fun with him. And he didn't obviously see it that way, but I can understand why. But it was fun. I'm from Australia, bro. One of the greatest island homes. You are a Torres Strait Islander from Canberra. You just got the key to the city in July. What does that mean? Can you just walk oh. into any restaurant and say, hey, th this is what I want to eat tonight and just go get ice cream whenever you want? Like, what's it mean? Uh, it's a good question because I, I don't actually know what it means. Um, I think uh, I remember asking a question about parking tickets and, <laughs> and whether or not you, you still get parking fines. But no, look, it's, it's obviously a very great honour to be able to um, be presented with the uh, keys to the city of Canberra, but also the keys um, to the Torres Strait, which was um, an unbelievable experience as well. I just have uh, you know enormous amount of thanks that I have to give to, to everyone who, who supported and, and watched throughout this, this, you know, my whole career. I witnessed it when I went back and I witnessed how many people came out to see and for that, you know, I'm truly grateful. It really means a lot, yeah. Let's go back to this moment. We interviewed you right after game five when you clinched the title. And I said, what was that like? When you're going off in the third quarter, you score 14 points and this place is going crazy. And you said, hopefully it can sink in now so I can describe it, but I can't. <laughs> Have you taken some time to think about what that moment was like and how special that yeah. moment was for you? Yeah, I mean, you constantly try to re relive it because it's such a um, unique time and it all happens so fast that you think back and, and, and realize you know what, what has happened. I think the trophy tour and, and events like that where where you see how many people come up and how much it impacted a whole country. Examples like that really help it sink in. But for me, it was just such a whirlwind experience and, and one you know, that I think back on and, and how loud the, the, the atmosphere was in the arena. And then obviously, you know, you, you see the banner and, and you see everyone together today. Um, it's all smiles and everyone's glad to, to, you know, to have each other back and, and have each other's company again. No, you won't be playing, but are you going on the trip to Germany? I believe so. Obviously a different training regime than, than everyone else, but, uh, but I am going. And for me, another goal is to make sure that I'm still amongst the boys and, and the guys and, and uh, don't pull myself apart. How much are you going to miss? your dog when you're away. You've posted these pictures on Twitter where you've got allergies, your medicine's not working right, so you're wearing ski goggles just to walk your dog. We went home for the summer, which we were away for two months. I don't know if it was me that missed him the most or he, him missing missing us the most, um, but I am gonna miss him. Um, I felt like seeing him um, now, we've had some good time together and um, he constantly gives me looks like, never leave me for that long again. <laughs> How much are you looking forward to getting back on the court and trying to help this team repeat something this organization has never done? It's a new vibe, it's a new challenge, it's a new goal and, and a new determination you, you, you feel just from saying hello to everyone because that is in, in the back of our head and obviously we haven't had any meetings yet. But for me, I do have a new challenge in front of me, so I am looking forward to getting back out there. It's a different method now in a different way, but yeah, I am excited to get out there just to, to make sure that the, the shoulder's healthy and everything else, else is, is healthy and get out there and, and do your best.